What's good? Y'all know who it is. Y'all know what it is. It's your boy, Matthew Shack, live here in Los Angeles. Welcome to Matthew Shack Unfiltered. The Kevin Durant sweepstakes isn't quite over because right now the Boston Celtics seem to be the odds on favorite to land Durantula himself, man. And I was just thinking about what would happen if that occurred? But let's just recap for those of you guys who have been uh, under a rock or those of you guys who have been too busy living your lives to understand what's happening in the National Basketball Association. Kevin Durant requested a trade last month, you know, in lieu of Kyrie Irving not receiving a, um, a super max contract. He's on the he's also a, a potential move. But uh, a lot of the people who were interested in Kevin Durant have bowed out. Uh, the Suns were a very hot commodity until they re-signed DeAndre Ayton. So their money's limited. Um, the Miami Heat are still in the in the hunt. The Toronto Raptors are still in the hunt. There was there was conversations about Golden State trying to reacquire them. But the Nets want everything. The Nets want the kitchen kitchen cabinets. They want the sink. They want the pergo floors. They want the the old ass microwave and they want the popcorn popper. They want everything, dog. They want everything because why? Because Brooklyn knows nobody's coming. Nobody wants to play over there, dog. You lose KD, you lose Kyrie, or if you keep them, no one's going to come over there because it's dysfunctional and it's toxic. Your best bet is to try to get as many assets as possible. And the Boston Celtics, who just lost to Golden State, have enough. They have enough capital to make it happen. There's already been a potential um, offer that uh, the Celtics have implemented to try to secure Kevin Durant's services by offering um, uh, Jalen Brown. And, you know, uh, Jalen Brown, um, Derek White and a couple of draft picks. And of course the Nets are like, hell nah, dog, that ain't enough. They they say they man throwing Marcus Smart too. And I'm gonna say something right now, dog. Boston and you Boston fans out there, first of all, we all know Jason Tatum is untouchable. You don't you don't even he's not even on the menu. Okay? Like, oh what about that guy over there? He's not even on the menu, dog. That's one. Two, you got to keep some pieces. Marcus Smart is the, is the reigning defensive player of the year. You got to try to keep Marcus Smart, man. Jalen Brown, as talented as he is, he's 25 years old. He has a lot of upside. Um, he played decently well. Well, he played as well as he could against the Golden State. When, when Tatum was falling off, he picked up the slack. And when... He fell off. Tatum picked up the slack. But to get Kevin Durant, come on, man. That's a no-brainer. That's a no-brainer. But you don't want to decimate your team because then you have you have Kevin Durant and you have Mark, um, Jason Tatum and then you have a bunch of other cats. But at the end of the day, man, if KD goes, if KD goes to the Celtics, man, for Jalen Brown and, you know, a couple of other little role players – and some draft picks, I don't see anybody being able to come out of the East. Kevin Durant over there with a potential team, the only thing I see is a problem, they don't have a point guard. But Kyrie Irving was supposed to be the point guard on that team until he got ran out of bean time. So we're going to see what's up, man. But as of now, there's no rush. Um, the NBA training camp starts on uh, September 26th, so you have all this time until training camp starts. So this is kind of like the free agent time to see what's popping, see what can happen. But if I was Boston, there would be a limit. I wouldn't just try to give everything. Nets want everything. They wanted everything from Golden State. They they wanted damn near everybody. Jordan Poole, uh, uh, Kominga. They wanted everybody, dog. They wanted everybody off of that damn bench and draft picks. Not conditional ones, draft picks, first round, and it's that second, all that kind of stuff. Same thing here, man. Boston, 
if you can get it done with Jalen Brown, Derek White, a couple of draft picks, maybe some of these other cats, you make that move, dog. This is Kevin Durant we're talking about. All right, man. Love all y'all out there, man. Matthew Shack on Filter.